Hi, Ruronis. This is your pal, Ruroni K95 here. And once again, it's time for another manga update video. Yep, I wanted. I haven't done a manga update video because I have been busy on doing some anime reviews as well in the past week I have done. And before we dive into the manga updates I have picked from my manga collection, I decided to order four manga books and a couple of anime DVDs on right stuff. And it's going to take... give it some time to let it ship and all. I had to pay $47 on right stuff for four manga books and a couple of DVDs of anime. Because, yeah, I haven't done anything on my previous unboxing from right stuff. If you haven't seen, you know, just like I did with my previous video where I showed you the $10 blind box unboxing from Right Stuff, which it has got to me. So I might, well, I'll do an anime and manga from Right Stuff unboxing video at this point, unless it comes in the mail, because I'm going to have to give it its time, because it takes time to tell as well. So today's anime... To, so today's manga update, we're going to be doing some manga genre categories, starting with some romantic comedy. Let's start. The first one I have is Volume 1 of Ayori Aoshi, Volume 1. This is my first Ayori Aoshi manga. This is basically Volume 2. I need to get Volume 1 as well as the rest of the volumes of the manga. Yeah, I think I read this, but there is the anime. But... Yep, it's just how it is what it is. Especially if you see the, the pages of the manga, what Ayori Aoshi is. Yep, in case you're wondering as well. Yep, this is published by Tokyo Pop. In case you're wondering. Yeah. Yeah, this is the first, yeah. This is my first Ayori Aoshi manga I have. And I have Volume 2 of Fruits Basket. This is my first Fruits Basket manga I've ever owned. I did an anime review on the 2003 Fruits Basket anime series. I have read the manga, but I haven't seen the 2019 Fruits Basket that came out recently. Last year. But here's the pages of the manga. Some of them can put with notes on it, because your typical shoujo manga that is under the category genre of romance and comedy in it. In case you're wondering in there, yeah. speaking of Fruits Basket, I have another volume, which is this one. In case you're wondering, this is volume 4, I guess? Yeah, I think this is volume 4 of Fruits Basket, in case you're wondering you notice. Yep. Yeah. It's just how it is what it is, because if you want to see the pages, in case you're wondering, in the Fruits Basket manga. Yep. Because it's I have been reading the manga because yeah, this is published by Tokyo Pop as well. And I also have Fruits Basket Volume 6 in case you're wondering as well. Is there some of the pages in the Fruits Basket manga, as you notice, in case you're wondering? Yeah, this particular manga I have. It looks like because I got volumes 4 and 6 of Fruits Basket as well. And I also have another Fruits Basket volume, because I got more of those, because I have volume 16, which I have shown you before, as well, on those pages. Because I know what you're thinking, if you want to see those pages. Yeah, because I think I got this at the library book sales as well, in case you want to really want to know. And I also got Volume 17 of Fruits Basket, because it's the best-selling shoujo manga from Tokyo Pop, because Tokyo Pop has been out of business, apparently. These were put out by Tokyo Pop, because I had to get my hands on all of those volumes. Yeah, in case you're wondering, as well. Yeah, this is another volume I got. And I also have Fruits Basket Volume 18, 
which I've shown you before. Because I know one of you want me to show the pages of the manga. Yeah, especially that one as well. And I got Fruits Basket Volume 19, another volume, which I've shown you in my previous manga update in the past as well. In case you're wondering, you see those pages of the manga. Yep, especially that one as well. And I also have Fruits Basket Volume 22. Yeah, those pages like these, because these were published by Tokyo Pop as well. And I also have Gravitation. Yeah, I think I've read this before. This is actually my first... Yeah, this is basically Volume 7, because I need to get the rest of Gravitation manga, in case you're wondering. Especially if you want to check this, the pages in the manga as well. Yeah, because you have to read it under reverse like that. Because that's how we'll, when you read a manga, which it's just how it is, what it is, especially as well. Yeah, this is my first gravitation manga. And next I have Volume 1 of Heaven. This is another romantic comedy manga I have. This is published by Tokyo Pop that brought you Fruits Basket as well. In case you're wondering. Because I have a lot of these mangas I have. Because I've shown you these, I might have got these at the book sale for like, along with Three Duties of Anime, when I did my anime manga haul video, especially that. And next I have is Kimagari Orange Road, this is volume 2, this is like a Chinese import translated of the original Japanese manga, which I'll show you. Yeah, there is also the Kimagari Orange Road anime. In case you're wondering, this is my first. Yeah, I think when I first read volume 13 of it, because I'll get to that in a moment, I have another volume of Kamagari Orange Road. In case you want to see the pages on there. Yep, I had to get this one as well. Because these were like 50 cents each when I first picked those up at a library book sale. Because I wanted to do an anime manga haul video as well. Yeah, especially Kimagari Orange Road. Yeah. I haven't seen the anime, but I'm going to have to give this anime a watch somehow at one point. Yeah, I mean, the characters look like something It reminds me something look, that looked like Rumiko Takahashi. An influent art style vibe in it. But it's not Rumiko Takahashi's work. Because that... Which I'll. Which is. Oh, yeah, because it's made by Izumi Matsumoto as well. My. Probably the heavily influenced on it. And I have another volume of Kamagori Orange Road, which is volume 6. Yeah, which I was going to show you in case you want to know. Especially that one. Because some of the pages I have when I was trying to read it, some of those pages were falling down and all. Because I might need some glue, like super glue and all, in case they don't fall. Like, especially if you see the one of the pages as well. I had to get this as well. And I have Kimagri Orange Road Volume 8. The most recent manga I've read. Yeah, especially on those pages, in case you want to know. Because it's just how it is, what it is. And I have Kimagri Orange Road Volume. Yeah, this is so tongue in cheek. But I know there's some supernatural moments in Kimagri Orange Road. Because the genre of the manga is basically like romantic comedy and supernatural as well, according to Wikipedia. Especially Kimagri Orange Road, especially, in case you're wondering. Yep, I had another got another volume as well. And I have Kamagri Orange Road Volume 11. Some of the pages were falling because I need some glue for that. Or some, yeah, some super glue, in case if it happens. Because I have to be very more careful. Because, in case you're wondering, and I have another volume of Kamagri Orange Road Volume 12 that I was going to show you. There's the pages on there. 
like that. I think I had to get that one. And I have volume 13 of Kamagri Orange Road, which is... Oh yeah, surprisingly... I had to get this. This was only 50 cents each when I first got this as well. And next I have My Love Story. This is another manga. This is from the creator who did High School Debut, which I was going to show you in case you're wondering. There's some of the pages on there. Yeah, because it's just how it is what it is. And I have Oran High School Host Club, Volume 9. This is my first time I get to own this. Because I have watched the anime. Yeah, I really enjoy the anime, though. But the manga, I need to read more. Of. I need to get some more of it. There's Oh My Goddess, Leader of the Pack manga. I got this for like a dollar, I believe. It's from Kosikuki Fujishima on there. Yeah, I had to get this as well. And I have Volume 3 of Oh My Goddess. I had to get this as well. Yep. Had, it's only like a dollar at a book sale. And I got another one I have here. Some more of the Oh My Goddess manga. Yep. Especially that. And I have Volume 7 of Oh My Goddess. Especially like this one. And I have Volume... 12 of the Oh My Goddess manga, which I've shown you before on my most previous manga update videos. And next I have is Ranma Half Volume 1. I got this for the first time on my previous manga update video last year, back in 2018, which is two years ago. Yeah. Even though I, I have watched the finished reading the entire manga series, and I as well as I did watch the entire anime as well, especially Ranma Half. Yep, because this is my first time I get to own Volume 1. And now I own this, because I love me some Rumiko Takahashi. And I got Volume 2 of Ranma Half. I got this on Amazon as well. Yep. Can't go wrong with Ranma Half, especially. And I have Volume 18 of Ranma Half. I had to get this as well. Uh, yep. This is another one I got, because I was... On the, on the brink of finishing the entire, reading the entire manga. And I have another volume of Ranma Half. Yep. Especially when I was reading the entire, yeah, especially Ranma Half, I have volume 19 of it. 20 I meant. I thought I said 19. I need to get it. And I have volume 22 of Ranma Half. I know it's romantic comedy, but there's also action and martial arts in the series, because I know some of them, this was adapted into an anime TV series as well. I had to get this one as well. And I have volume 25 of Ron Mahaf as well, which I've shown you before, like that. Yep. Because I know I had to get this. This is only like a dollar, I guess, in case you're wondering. Oh, and I also got more Ranma. Some more Ron Mahaf I have. Sorry about that. I have Ron Mahav Volume 34, which I've shown you before. And I have Ron Mahav Volume 35, which I've shown you before in my most recent manga update video. As well as in the Viz Media Manga Collection, which I do like a... Because I had to do like an overview on all of those titles from Viz Media. Especially I have this. And the last one I got to cover this video is Yurisei Yatsura Volume 1, The Return of Lum, Yurisei Yatsura. Yep, especially this, because I had to read it, because I considered it to be my favorite manga, that's why. It's from Rumiko Takahashi, I guess. So that's going to be for my manga update. Thank you for watching, but before we go, because I had ordered some from Right Stuff, because this is my thoughts I have for this video, because it's been a while, since I haven't done a manga update in a while, because I was busy with my anime reviews, I guess. Hope subscribe for content, my anime plan, link in the description down below, you can share this video on your Twitter, Facebook, if you have a Twitter, Facebook account, all social media, be sure to give this video a thumbs up by clicking on the like button on this video, feel free to leave in the comments in the comments section, be sure to subscribe to my channel, RuronyK95, feel free to join my channel, especially if you're new to my channel, hit the notifications bell button, be sure to get notified, and keep it otaku for this manga update, because it's been a while since I have done a manga update. This is Roni K95 saying thank you for watching my manga update video, and I will see you soon for more videos. Yes, and I'll, yep, and and also this is Roni K95 saying I'm off, and I will see you soon for more videos because we're running out of time.